hello viewers welcome back to my channel this question is show that integrate one by one plus tan into dx with limit pi by two zero is equal to pi by one is turned into show that this function should be equal to pi by two so first what we have to do solution then next now write zero pi by two one by one plus ta write tan x in terms of write tan x as sine by cos why we are writing so sine by cos we don't have diagonal formula for this okay sine by cos is equal to tan you can write tan x as sine by cos okay so what becomes sine x sine x by cos x into dx now cross multiply and take lc so we are going to integrate 0 pi by 2 1 by so multiply means cos x plus sin x by cos x into send you cos x in numerator so at last will become integrate 0 pi by pi by 2 cos x by cos x plus sin x this is our i let take it as i take it as i okay and make it as first equation okay next also i is equal to also take it this one also i is equal to integrate 0 pi by 2 now here we are using one function what function we are using integrate uh, with limit a 0 f of x into dx is equal to equal to integrate 0 a a f of a minus x into dx now we are using this property for every single ratio of this so it becomes the now it becomes what is the kya a cos pi by 2 minus x by we are using this property for sing, every single ratio okay now in the denominator also cos pi by 2 minus x plus sine pi by 2 minus x now in trigonometry table pi by 2 is equal to 90 means cos 90 minus theta cos 90 minus 90 minus theta is equal to sin theta okay then sin 90 minus theta sin 90 minus theta is equal to cos theta okay now it becomes what it becomes when we do like this then integrate 0 pi by 2 then now cos 90 minus theta means sin theta so up in the numerator becomes sin x by cos 90 minus theta means sin x plus sin 90 minus theta means cos cos theta so cos a into dx now take it as yeah, also dx now take it as equation 2 and next what do you have to do add add 1 plus 2 this 2 function we have to add it so it what it becomes here i am writing here okay so it will be easy to understand so here here also i only okay so i plus i so i plus i is equals to integrate 0 pi by 2 cos x by cos x plus sin x into dx then plus we are adding the two functions okay then 0 pi by 2 then second function sin x by sin x plus cos x into dx now i plus i means 2i equal to now add it so here becomes cos x plus sin x 
now take it at common so it becomes by sin x plus cos x with limit 0 pi by 2 so yet this both the numerator and denominator function get cancelled into dx at the what is uh, remaining to i is equal to a to i is equal to integrate 0 pi by 2 dx now integrate it so it becomes integrate dx integrate dx is equal to a dx is equal to x so it becomes x with limit pi by 2 and 0 and you order f x here up now f x a okay then f b minus f a okay the upper limit is pi by 2 minus the lower limit is 0 known as a now substitute it to 2i is equal to pi by 2 minus 0 so 2i is equal to pi by 2 send this 2 here so it becomes 2 2 is 2 here it divide multiply so it will divide so in the denominator multiply so i is equal to pi by 4 at last we prove that i is equal to pi by 4 at last what have to write the question therefore 0 pi by 2 1 by 1 plus tan x is equal to dx is equal to pi by 4 this is our lhs is equal to rh thanks for watching